Hello, this is Anna Goji here, and welcome to another video. <laughs> and welcome to uh, G Fest vlog. And yeah, I know I'm a little bit late on this. I actually am. Um, this is basically <laughs> vlog of two announced my experience at G Fest that I did go this year. For people who don't know, I did go to G Fest this year. I think the guys in the community knows. I'm not sure if my my fan base knows that I actually went to G-Fest, but I went to G-Fest. But, basically, if for those of you who don't know what G-Fest is, it's basically a place for where Godzilla fans and can show their appreciation for Godzilla in Chicago. Yeah, that's basically, that's basically to summarize it. And I'm just going to be for this vlog, I'm just going to be focusing at on day zero, aka what most people like to call the day before the actual convention starts. But basically, day zero. Uh, day zero was it was pretty good. It, I loved, I loved it. Even though I did get spooked afterwards because I was like left alone in the middle. of in the middle of the night, no lights, no nothing. I legit almost got kidnapped. <laughs> okay, that's that's no joke. It was scary as hell, but uh, moving on. <laughs> moving on. Moving on from that. But anyway. Thank God I had my bag with me. I was gonna use <laughs> anyway, anyway, moving on. <laughs> anyway. Uh, after Pickwick, I basically just stayed around the area, get some Panera and pizza that was like legit in that store that I didn't even know was there that last time I went when I went there last year. And the pizza was actually pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. If people who work at that pizza place uh, watch this video, that's some good pizza. <laughs> it's some really good pizza. I ate like most of it. I ate most of it. It was pretty good. It was really good. That was some good pizza. But anyway, I overall enjoyed Chief. Um, I overall enjoyed my time at the Pickwick, even though there were. The, when you go to a convention, you're going to have some of those people who are going to be that. Luckily, there were only a few of those, but for the most part, everybody was pretty cool. <laughs> and. I did sit through like the first two movies and I did enjoy them. Oh, wait, was it first? I know I sat through Destroy All Monsters and because of any games, even though I went to the bathroom a lot, I legit had stomach problems. I don't know why. <laughs> but I went to, I did see all of Destroy All Monsters and I did see Godzilla Vance again. And I'm, like I said, guilty pleasure of mine, Godzilla Vance again. Guilty pleasure. <laughs> and I walked out of Godzilla 1998. That's no joke. I walked out. I just came back in to boo it. And I came in. And I came back in at the best part. The end of the movie. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I couldn't help myself with that. Legit, like, the end of the movie. Legit, the end of the movie. I should have probably not done that, but man. And then, I think the last movie that we saw that day was uh, King Kong Escapes. And... We heard the, uh, and it was like a special presentation from at uh, James Wolf. Apparently, James Wolf made that presentation. I think I'm a. I'm not sure if he actually made that presentation, but I digress. And overall, it was pretty good. It could have been a little bit shorter because it did last for like ten minutes. <laughs> And it could have been a tiny bit shorter, like at least five minutes. It did feel like they were just dragging it out. <laughs> like, no joke, it legit lasted 10 minutes. And people were applauding at the very beginning. And then people were just, then just went silent. I was like, I was waiting for, like, I was literally legit doing this. It's like, okay, hurry up. <laughs> it was legit pretty long. Not to discredit Kong fans or anything, but it what not to discredit the people who made that, but it, you could have made it at least a little bit shorter. 
And then I saw King Kong escapes at the Pickwick, and I'm not sure how I feel about that film. I'm not sure. I have. It's. I think I enjoyed it. It's basically a Tony Point off movie. It, it's good. It's bad in a good way. It's like uh, so cheesy that it's good. One of those bad movies that's so cheesy that it's good. <laughs> you know, you know what I'm talking about. And that was basically Day Zero. And I spent like most of my time just watching movies at the Pickwick, which was pretty fun. I was kind of disappointed that they didn't show Shin Ochman. For those who don't know, they didn't show Shin Ochman at the Pickwick because they wanted to. I'm assuming because they showed King Kong Escapes. I'm assuming they wanted to show they wanted the little Miller, but if that's the case, shouldn't they just you know replace G Gaza 2014 with Shin Ultraman? That would have made more sense, but I'm not the one playing this, so yeah. But who knows? Maybe they play Shin Ultraman that's yeah. And that was basically day zero. It was pretty fun overall, a good entertainment. Even though I did walk a lot and I probably lost a lot of weight. <laughs> I've been losing a lot of weight. But but it was overall a good time. And it was okay. Give it a thumbs up. And I'll be doing some more G Fest spots later on later through the week. I'll probably do like a couple of tomorrow. I'll probably do like two tomorrow. And then do one on Monday. Yeah. But that said, does that go G? Oh, also notice the cap. <laughs> Couldn't help myself. Now I'm officially, yeah. <laughs> anyway, this is Anagogy signing off. Remember, stay big. Stay big, G fans. <laughs>